What are you doing here? Sorry, I should have called you or something. I just, I, I wanted to see you. It's been a while. Yeah, Cisco said that he saw you at the Flash Day celebration. I was surprised. You better than anyone know that I wasn't the hero that day. Of course you were. No. Kate Ronnie died saving me, and I, I should have saved them, and I'm, I'm so sorry. Gary, I know that you did everything you could. It wasn't your fault. I don't blame you for Ronnie's death. I blame myself. Why? When Ronnie first became Firestorm, he asked me to leave Central City and go somewhere that we could have a normal life. And I said, no. I couldn't leave Star Labs, Dr. Wells, you. If I had gone with him, Ronnie would still be alive. Being at Star Labs just made me think of that every single day. Yeah. Oh, you carry a handkerchief now? What are you, 80? Uh, <clears throat> What's that? Uh, it's, uh, apparently in the case of his death, Wells had some kind of a living will. And you haven't watched it yet? No. No, I've been too afraid. What if we watched it together? If you're watching this, that means something has gone horribly wrong. I'm dead, and the last 15 years have been for nothing. Bummer, 15 years. And when I realized in all those years helping raise you, we were never truly enemies, Barry. I'm not the thing you hate. And so, I'm gonna give you the thing that you want most. It won't matter. You'll never be truly happy, Barry Allen. Trust me, I know you. Now, <clears throat> erase everything I said up to this point. Give the following message to the police. My name is Harrison Wells. Being of sound mind and body, I freely confess to the murder of Nora Allen in her home on the night of March 18th in the year 2000. I attacked Nora Allen. Oh my God. He confessed. This is what I need to free my dad. Hey, Joe. Yeah, hey, um, can you have everybody meet me at Star Labs? Yeah, all right, thanks. Yeah, all right, bye. I'll try. 